can feel the sense of occasion here. El Clasico, one of world football's great occasions. No rivalry more intense. Unmistakably, this is the Camp Nou, staging a game in the way only the Camp Nou can. It's a friendly in theory, but we are expecting this to be fiercely contested. I'm sitting here, Peter, thinking, is it possible for these two to meet under friendly circumstances? This exhibition match is likely to exhibit the same old rivalry. To me, it also has the same feel to it. And I'm pretty sure we can look forward to what will be a combative, high-intensity affair. We can't really say anything negative about this, and if it is full on, then I'll be happy to watch that. So we're up and running. Sergio Ramos. Rafael Varane. Forward it goes. Oh, good take and, a and the shot! That's offside, yes it is. Ter Stegen sends that a long way. Oh, good interception. Pjanic. And here's Griezmann. This is gone, that's a foul. it away that's our conjuring up some magic on the right hand side and it's Benzema Valverde Benzema shot and goal marvellous goal what a start and what a contribution from the main man I had a feeling he might do something given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. Ter Stegen reacted well to the... Well, a very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day. A rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. Well, Manchester clearly one of the genuine footballing hubs in England. And here is the hallowed turf, which is Old Trafford. It's a friendly. The crowd clearly doesn't think so. Oh, in actual fact, the way. I'm sitting here, Peter, thinking, 
is it possible for these two to meet under friendly circumstances? This exhibition match is likely to exhibit the same old rivalry. To me, it also has the same feel to it. And I'm pretty sure we can look forward to what will be a combative, high-intensity affair. We can't really say anything negative about this. And if it is full on, then I'll be happy to watch that. There's the whistle, and here we go. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Virgil van Dijk. He's just about unbeatable in every department, Peter. He's strong, he's quick, he's totally dominant in the air. And what's more, he seems to really love a tussle. His passing's good too, and he never seems to lose it in important areas. I'd expect this team to notch up a lot of clean sheets with him on board. Yeah, I must agree, especially in view of his ability to lead and organise the defence. Forward it goes. Thiago. Alexander-Arnold. Salah. Mane. He's played him through. That's from Firmino! He's delivered all right! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. The understanding between those two plays a big part in that and releasing them. Well, greetings everyone and welcome to a match like no other. They call it Der Klassiker. And indeed, these fixtures very often do turn out to be absolute classics. Bayern Munich against Borussia Dortmund, so much talent on either side, it really turns out to be a damp squib. The fans certainly gearing up for what should be a pulsating encounter. The noise level here is off the charts. There is considerable hostility. The supporters right behind their teams, as they will be from the moment the whistle blows, but they will be nervous too. It carries so much significance, this. The players have to get their mentality right. They need to want to win. They need not to fear making what could be the telling error. Those who haven't the mental aptitude can go missing on occasions such as this. It is the stars who shine when the stage is at its most lit up. So kickoff is approaching very fast now. There are a few formalities left to finalise. Time to get sat for a Classica encounter. We are in this super stadium for a super club, truly one of the iconic buildings of 21st century sports, the Allianz Arena. This is a friendly, but a friendly only in name. Well, exhibition match sounds like an easy ozy game of football, Peter, and a picture-perfect occasion until the word pride gets a mention. And it's likely... To... Big chance! Oh, that's fantastic! And if that's a sign of things to come, he could make himself unplayable here. On some occasions, when star players really mean business, the entertainment value rockets, and we could be in for a treat after such a stunning opening. Absolutely thundered in. Keeper, no chance. Oh, the contact was fantastic. Right on the boot laces and it packed a lot of venom for what was a really potent strike. It's here at last, it is Milan derby day. The city comes to a complete standstill. It means everything to everyone in these parts. The atmosphere in the stadium reflects that. 
noise and colour and no little hostility. The passion just about tangible. You've got to spare a thought if you can for the players and managers. They have to try and keep a cool head amidst all this fervour to try and play not just the occasion but the match itself. And that is never easy. But there are, of course, many decent players. There have been many greats through the generations. And there is no doubt that while certain players might struggle with the atmosphere, there are some who become heroes today. It is close to unpredictable. Whatever happens, though, I think we are in for one of those footballing treats. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. This is a friendly, but a friendly only in name. Well, I think we know what we're in for, whatever the circumstances that exist when these two meet. Losing really isn't an option, making this another intense, feisty clash, which should keep everyone on edge. The fans are more nervous than the players, to me, confirming an atmosphere of, of angst. Try telling them there's nothing riding on this. And that gets things running. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Christian Eriksen. He's super accurate with both feet, Peter, and able to deliver a cross or a through ball with just the perfect bend or indeed weight. All this allied. To... And a header! There it is! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for. A player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. What a great header, got plenty on that. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch.